Hey guys, Pillow here. Before we start this video, I just want to let you know um, something happened with the game audio for this episode. I'm not completely sure what, but uh, game audio is going to be very low and my voice is going to be a little bit louder than usual, so I apologize for that first off. Um, I'd lost probably about a good hour of recording, but you know what, that's okay. Uh, I figured we would just uh, round up this chapter, and uh, from there on I will do my best to fix the audio issues, but uh, thank you for sticking through it, um, and enjoy. Bye. Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Celeste, chapter four, episode five. I'm actually very proud of myself that I got that right. And welcome back to my room where I record with uh, guinea pigs running around scurrying in the background with no carpet. Uh, thanks for tuning in uh, and <clears throat> clicking on the video. And while you're at all of that clicking, why don't you go ahead and click the like button, the subscribe button, and uh, if you're brave, Go ahead and hit the share button, too. All right, and where we last left off, we got past a pretty difficult room. And uh, we are now headed into... Oh, no! I think I'm dead. Yeah, definitely dead there. Uh, we are just headed further and further up the mountain. I'm dead again. I need to be sure of myself after that second spring. All right, here we go. There we go. That's all I needed. Um... Oh no. Oh man, really uh, lucked out there. I have no clue where I'm going, but we're just gonna progress, progress up, right? And uh, broke a thing there. I don't think there was any point to that, but we shall see. Yeah, this wind is so hard I got to, I have to dash. <laughs> Oh man, I hate wind mechanics in games. I know I said that last time, but I just, I really do. Really hate them. They're just more trouble than they're worth. Oh man. I'm not even sure how this one is supposed to work. There we go. Nothing like, at the end of a puzzle, needlessly clicking the dash button. I'm pretty sure those are going to kill me. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, they will. Okay. Good to know. Wind might keep me from going back, but it seems I can still climb vertically as good as I can any other time. Um, Alright, let's, yeah, there we go. So anyway, oh man, how is uh, how's everyone's day going? Hope your day is going well. If you had a good day, go ahead and tell me in the comments. But uh, uh, and you know what? This time, if you had a bad day, uh, I don't care today. You know, because we're not gonna just keep saying the same thing every video, even if it is a really nice thing. We're gonna change it up a little bit. Uh, Gotta tell you, it is so hard to provide commentary and play this game. I couldn't have probably picked a worse game to try as my first Let's Play. But <laughs> I knew, I knew that was gonna happen. See, last stream it didn't though, so that's not fair. Let's wait for it. Okay, there we go. Yeah, last room, whenever we got close to the end, no silly snowball came through to kill us. Wow. That really just knew where we were going to be. Oh man, I hate this so much. <laughs> so much hate in me right now for this. Oh no! Like, see, it now, now the snowballs are starting to predict where we're going to be, rather than right where we're at. And man, okay. I'm really struggling here with this. Alright. Nice of them to let you get to these little spots to take a break, though. 
Wow. So I just got back from a nice day at work. And by nice, I mean about as nice as a, any retail job can be. If you, is that flag stopping me? If you work retail, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Even your good days are kind of like, meh. Like, no one, no one yelled at me or got extremely mad, so it was there for a good day. But I'm not gonna lie, I don't, I don't hate my job. I don't hate it. I need to save my hate for more important things. There we go, that was satisfying. Nice, satisfying room after the hard one. There we go, now this, this one will be a hard one. Gotta keep it nice and balanced. Like a part of a breakfast. Oh no! Nice, and the wind dies down, and now we have wind basically doing the opposite of what it was before. Oh man, um, I don't know if I should try to get that strawberry or not. Oh no! <laughs> okay. Definitely pressed the jump button there whenever I meant to press the dash button. Oh no! And we have the strawberry in our hands too! Hmm. Oh. Just got finished uh, eating some cauliflower pizza. If you've never had cauliflower crust pizza, I gotta tell you, from Aldi, it's, it's actually pretty good. <clears throat> if someone, like, fed it to me and just told me, like, this is normal pizza, I would be like, oh, wow, that's just, you know, bad pizza. <laughs> it's just pizza with pretty bad crust. But, you know, it's still even... I wouldn't say bad pizza, actually. I would say just mediocre pizza. Oh, no. <clears throat> just gotta focus on going straight up for that one. We can do this. This is a pretty easy one. I'm just getting hung up at... I'm only getting hung up at two specific places. No! It's right there. It is right there and at the very end. If I can just get through those. There we go. Oh, ho, ho, one last little trap, huh? All right, and the uh, music has slowed down, so. Madeline, wait up. Don't know if you can hear my guinea pigs chewing on hay right now or not. Oh man, okay, so Theo is dead. Nailed it. <laughs> Theo, are you all right? Oof, yeah. Just give me a sec. A gondola. I've always wanted to ride one of these. It looks pretty old, but maybe it still works. I don't see any other way to cross this chasm. Look at these guys using words like gondola and chasm. What a what a phenomenal writing. Uh, this lever looks important, and words like important <laughs> and easy. Every time. It was probably a gondola operator, and I, I was probably a gondola operator in my past life. Uh, do you think this thing is safe? I'm sure it's fine. How did it shake out with Ashiro? You were right. I shouldn't have tried to help him. I hate to say it, I told you so, but. Yeah, yeah. I should have listened to you. You didn't get hurt. 
that's what matters. Oh, what a nice guy. <clears throat> the air is so thin up here. I can barely breathe. Okay, if we don't get a selfie on this thing, we're going to regret it. I can't even see the ground through the mist. How high up are we? Less panicking, more posing. Oh, well. What was that? Huh, looks like we stalled out. What a very calm guy. <laughs> this is really bad. Maybe if I make things worse. <laughs> well, that's not good. No, this really isn't good. Madeline, you cool? Yeah, I just... No, I'm not cool. I can't breathe. You're having a panic attack. Why would you think it's a good idea to ride this stupid thing? Come on, don't take this out on me. Stay with me here. My grandpa taught me a trick for this. Close your eyes. Picture a feather floating in front of you. See it? Okay. Your breathing keeps that feather floating. Just breathe slowly and steadily, in and out. Trying our best to keep the feather. Inside of the box. Oh no, it's way too high. Oh no, no, that's me. <laughs> no, I'm not controlling the box, I'm controlling the feather. Okay, it's gotta breathe, you know. There we go. Perfect. is not platforming, just rather relaxing. See? It's easy every time. Huh. Feeling any better? I think so. Thanks for helping me calm down. How did you know we'd start moving again? Oh, I totally thought we were done for. <laughs> but I got a good selfie. That's probably... Yep, exactly. What a guy. <laughs> and that wraps up this chapter of Celeste. Um, <clears throat> being someone who's actually suffered a, a panic attack before, I wish it was that simple as just a picture of feather and uh, breathe really calmly. Sometimes that's not really enough, but I think if you can catch it coming on, I think that's probably some great advice. All right, and that is about where we are going to wrap things up today. Thank you for sticking through. Uh, what I think, at least, is quite atrocious audio. Um, I know it was a short episode, too, so my apologies for many things. But thanks for sticking around. Uh, if you made it this far into the video, why don't you give it a like, uh, subscribe if you want to keep seeing the mess of things that I'm doing on this channel. And uh, once again, thank you for your precious time. Bye.